Hello there, my name is Julian Gaetan and I am the owner of Screaming Gold Productions. Before I get started, I would like to thank my contest host, Crazy Noob, for putting on this contest and inspiring me to make a video for this. It is my first contest entry ever and hopefully it goes smooth and hopefully I win, but if not, it was still fun making this video. Um, before I show off my, memor my memorabilia, I would like to um, talk about some of my favorite Halloween memories. Most of my Halloween memories I have are from my, probably my early 20s. When I was a kid, uh, I was one of those wannabe cool kids that really wasn't much into Halloween. I did dress up. When I, in 1992, when I was 10 years old, um, I wanted to be Raiden for, for Halloween. And uh, my, I went to a private school, right? So my school had a um, Halloween day parade or whatever, right? And my mother tried her hardest to to help me make a Raiden costume. <laughs> it just turned out to be, uh, we were able to find a karate outfit, which is cool, right? Which is fine. But we couldn't find one of those, you know, those hats that like are like, like that. So we ended up using some sort of sombrero that we found somewhere, probably a Chevy sombrero. Remember Chevys? <laughs> that was fun. Um, another year, another fun one was when I was, uh, I forget what I was for Halloween myself, but it was when I was in eighth grade and my brother was in second grade. And my brother wanted to be Sub-Zero, and they actually did sell, at that time, in 96, they sold a Sub-Zero, like, you know, kid costume, where it came with the blue suit and fake muscle and stuff, right? And uh, I remember my brother dressed up, he looked cool, right, whatever. And I remember <laughs> some kids in my class asked me if my brother really had those muscles. <laughs> to me, I thought that was hilarious. <laughs> and um, another good memory I have, too, was when, this is, this is in my, uh, uh, early 20s when I was around 22 I think about 10 11 years ago now and I remember I had gone on a date with this girl uh, I think her name was Angela um, this waitress I met at this restaurant she was uh, from a different country so it was her first time really experiencing Halloween and I live in San Francisco and in San Francisco there's this place called the Castle where Halloween gets nuts it's like um, they have a humongous 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 street party and people dress up People dress all scantily, people dress, you know, sometimes people are naked. It's absolutely nuts, you know, crazy nuts. And I remember taking her there, it was like kind of like our first date. And um, she was so fucking culture shocked, it was hilarious. Our relationship didn't go nowhere, but I thought it was funny because uh, there was women naked, there was men naked, everyone was taking pictures, everyone was drinking, and it was just such a fun time, but she was not from this country, so she never seen anything like that, and it was... She was shocking for her. She looked all nervous and scared and stuff. She dressed up like a, I would think like a, like a kitty cat. Where she had like the colored nose and the whiskers, and the little ears, right? I um, I think I was Marv that year from Sin City, some crappy version of Marv or whatever. But it was just funny to see her face and stuff, and it was kind of cool to show her how we we um, uh, we do Halloween in America, which is kind of a big deal. She was from, she was from South Korea, so I guess they do. Uh, they do uh, Halloween different there but yeah those are some of my favorite Halloween memories um, the, my favorite one to be honest was when where uh, my little brother dressed up as Sub-Zero and people asked me if that was real muscles <laughs> these people are idiots man <laughs> but it was just hilarious to me um, yeah I'm gonna be showing off some of my um, some, some of my horror stuff I don't have much you know mostly movies you know, mostly blu-rays but yeah uh, thanks again for your uh, fabulous contest and I hope to hear from you. Take care. Bye-bye.